we've got the long bunker shot. So you can see we've got about a 35 yard shot, a lot of green to cover. And really the key is actually the club selection and a little bit about the technique. So we're gonna get rid of your old trusty sand wedge. That's just too hard. That's just not gonna get the job done. So we're gonna get rid of that and in comes the magic eight iron. Okay, so don't be afraid. You can use pitching wedge, uh, nine iron, eight iron, seven iron, five iron even. You know, Seve was famous for using like a three iron from a bunker, for example. So this case, we're gonna go with an eight iron. What we're gonna do is this, a couple of little changes. We're gonna get even further away from the ball than normal, because obviously the shaft is longer. And therefore, this will create the effect, as you can see, our, our swing plane or the angle of the shaft becomes much flatter. We're gonna get down, let's say, quite wide with the stance and get down low, get the handle down low. And you can see the amount of loft we'll put on the face. So if we can now maintain that posture, stay low throughout the whole action, it becomes actually probably easier than what you might think and certainly a lot easier than using a sand wedge. So let's get in position. I'm almost actually slightly closed here with the stance. So I'm gonna image like a little sort of a, a sort of a draw shape. I'm gonna get low, put a little bit more weight on my left foot. And then from there, we're gonna have a nice sort of low feeling in the swing. Boom, there we go, close to the flag. Okay, so we've shown you how to do this with an A-time. We're now gonna do this in true Seve style. We've got the three iron out. So, same rules. We're gonna get the club down really low. We're probably gonna be a bit further away than before. Club face nice and open. Stay low and just commit to the shot. Thank you.